Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials in Hand. In this video, we are going to write a program in Python in order to print whether a number is positive or not. So without further ado, let's get started with it. So for example, suppose if the number is 5, then the output should be yes, the number is positive. And let's say the number is minus 8, then the output should be no, the number is negative. Now let's quickly move to VS Code in order to start writing the program. So first of all, we will create a new file. Let's create it by clicking onto this icon and give it a name. Let's say positive or not. Dot py. Now let's create a new variable. Uh, let's call it as num and we initialize it with any value. Uh, initially, let it be minus nine. Now, one thing that we should think over here is that th three conditions are possible. That is, the number can be either negative or positive or it can be zero. So what we will do is how we will uh, identify what exactly it is by simply applying a logic that if the number is greater than zero, then the number is positive. If it is lesser than zero, that means the number is negative. And if it's identical to zero, that means it's uh, zero simply. So what we will do is we will simply check if the number is greater than zero, that means what it's positive. So we will print positive. Let's simply print positive. Now, in the else part, we will also apply elif that is if the number is less than zero, that means the number is what? Negative. So we will uh, print simply negative. Now, in the third condition, we will simply put else and we will, within the indented part, we will uh, print zero. So the, the thing that it will work is that first of all, it will check if the whether the number is greater than zero. If that's true, then it will say that, yeah, it's positive. If it's not true, then it will go and it will check whether the number is less than zero. Then it, if it's true, then it will say that, yeah, the number is negative. If still it's not true, then it will move to the else part and it, it will say that, yeah, if the number is not greater than zero and if it's not even lesser than zero, that means the number is zero itself. So it will simply print zero. Now let's try to run this program and see uh, it happening. Oh, uh, so over here I missed the colon just. Yeah, let's rerun it. And here you can see that it says that the number is negative. Uh, let's try it with zero and see if it works. And see, you can see that uh, it is printing zero. So this is uh, all about the video. It's quite uh, very simple. Now in this, three uh, basically two concept was only used that is how to use if statement and how to use elif statement if you uh, if your concept is not clear i think uh, by this only uh, it will be clear but still if you want to see a reference then in the description we will drop the link onto a separate video that that has already been uploaded which is exclusively for how to write if condition elif condition and all so uh, you might check them out so this was all about the video uh, thanks a lot